So in this video, we're going to help our merchant Boner Farms, awesome name by the way, on how to set up this label here uh, with variable price barcode parser on a Clover device. So first, let us take a, a, a closer look. All right, so we're looking for an app called Variable Price Barcode Parser, and we want to make sure that the configuration is complete and that app is ready for use. Now, to get this part done, we're going to close this app and we're going to open Settings, a different app. In Settings, we're going to navigate all the way down and click on Accessibility. And in Accessibility, we have Variable Price Barcode Parser that needs to be turned on like this, Use Services. Once that's done, configuration will be complete. The next step is to set this item up on a Clover Inventory app. So it looks like we have ground beef patties, one and a half. And I'm going to open inventory app right here. And we're going to search because I already set this up. So here's our ground beef patties. And let me show you how I have it set up. So the name has to match the label. The price type needs to be set up as variable. And then the product code needs to be literally the first six digits that you see on this label here, which is 210013. Those are the six digits. And we enter 210013 into the product code field. And that's all that is for the item. So we have it set. And now we can open our register app, select dine in, and simply scan this barcode. And we would get dollar three. And I'm assuming that this is a dollar three uh, because it is dollar three on the barcode, although it's not, it's 32 cents. Or maybe it's not. So it can be dollar three or because we can't confirm, like we don't know the the actual price. But there is a setting in a barcode parser that can read it like this or can read it like that. So if it reads it like this, it's gonna be a higher amount. Let me check. Register. Alright, now when we scan it, it's 1032. So if this, um, I think it's 1032 more, like if this is a 1032 label, then that was the setting. If it was a dollar three, then that was a different setting. And the setting again is right here in the variable price, barcode parser, settings, barcode types. And you can choose uh, to read either up to 999.99 or up to 99.99, whichever one works. Uh, if your barcode scanner is not picking this up, try using the built-in camera. You can open the register app and then click on the built-in camera here and it would open the camera and then you can scan the barcode against this thing here um, at the top right there. Um, and then if, if the camera works but the barcode scanner doesn't, that means your barcode scanner did not come from Clover. It may have come from some other source. Um, I hope this helps. Thank you.